Hi Taurus, how are you? This is a special tarot reading session for you Taurus. I hope you're well. The reading for today Taurus is ghosting or no contact tarot reading session for Taurus friends. Please universal energy, what can I get for Taurus? Why this person ghosted Taurus? Why there's no contact please? This is for Taurus friends. I hope you're okay. I hope you're well. This is for you awesome Taurus friends. Okay? First card is the Page of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles, the High Priestess, the Six of Wands. What's the current energy? What's their thoughts? What's their action? What is the reason? Okay. All right. Okay, let's start your reading, Taurus. I felt like in the past, Taurus, you've got Page of Pentacles, you've got the Queen of Wands, you've got the High Priestess. I felt like in the past stories it was going well there were some sort of reciprocation a give and take a response um, it was okay it was not perfect but it was okay um, in the past you felt that this person was committed uh, you felt that this person cares about you um, they do response when you call they listen to your stories you have some sort of a practical approach of how connection reconnection or dating you share a common interest you and your person you've got some some sort of mutual energy mutual feelings not just feelings but the way you approach life you have a approach life you have a similarity for example uh, you're at the same age you're both mature you're ready to settle down you have the same view of how how one's age should be get married something to do with you have the same view in life a lot of commonalities and views that you have uh, between you and your person okay and it brings you together whatever common things you have it brings you together and um, it, it it brings out chemistry like you know like twin flame kind of thing or you have a lot of similarities for example you came at you you live at the same place you you studied at the same school you took the same course you are at the same job career for some of you a lot of similarities that bring you together and ignite chemistry it, it keeps you more and more interested the more you get to know them and vice versa okay and then high priestess this is so you feel very connected you feel the past situation between you and your person it is right it is ripe for picking like this is a great connection i'd say and then the challenges on why this person ghosted you is that something was hidden um someone something was hidden you found out you know um because the star card is in reverse the six of wands and the king of cups i feel like for some of you this person ghosted you because it was going well for some of you from romantic it turns out to be more of a friendship it became platonic it didn't because in the beginning it was romantic because it was too common too familiar you became platonic it didn't hit off the ground of romantic or going to exclusive relationship it kind of went to playing safe or flat line you know it was the chemistry was great and then it was straightforward and it never surged up so it's kind of flat line um yeah for some of you it was platonic for some of you it was um page of ones for some of you someone just stopped calling or texting someone played hard to get you know someone let their ego or tested the other person it could be it could be them but someone tested okay i'm gonna try whether taurus is going to chase me i'm gonna hold back and you did not follow up you did not chase them and it ended up with ghosting or no contact you know six of ones it's things were going well but the ego the pride some sort of hidden agenda in secrecy also came into play that the supposedly romantic thing you shared that you were um trying to you know it's like baking you're trying to bake a bread and um you are into this bread you have quality ingredients and then at the last stage you put it in the oven you were kind of in a hurry that you forgot to put it in the right temperature it was under or overcooked 
okay because along the way you were so focused on preparing the ingredients mixing it but the final process that's where you fail okay so i feel like this is an almost relationship reading like it was almost there and then this one tiny error it blew it away all right like it's frustrating to like it's already in your hand like it's within reach it's almost perfect but the thing is it went bitter at the last stage all right in the immediate future i feel like this person they ghosted you um they have they've been exploring other people you know and um for some of you they move to another place um they travel they have some sort of a lot of social activity as well so wh when this person was ghosted you ghosting you um they explore other possibility of dating other people um not just you multiple because the the full card is because this was almost serious you know you know the three cards they were serious with you they were on it okay but someone played hard to get or there's some sort of blockages some sort of hidden agenda or secret thing that came out or playing hard to get but it was almost there that's what i'm getting in there almost there kind of thing and then it snapped and then both of you are kind of shy to reach out because you don't know now because it's been so long you don't know you don't know now how to define it like no one is making a follow-up and would like to define or to bring out in the table like hey we've got this beautiful connection what happened no one is answering or asking that to get an answer like i feel like both of you are kind of satisfied to leave it that way for some of you if you follow up with this person or if you call them i feel like this person um they're just into they've got other distraction or other stuff they've been foolish because you know it's in the last process and they've kind of chicken out or step back and explored someone someone something else if it's not a third party where they could possibly dated another person while because i feel like something was interrupted interrupt in, sorry interrupted while you were dating and then you guys went to a no contact in between no contact they met someone they dated and they've kind of enjoyed that but you know the two of ones the last card they look back you know this person is looking back because you know the way we started off the reading it was serious there's a lot of chemistry that's why it's it's a lost it's a lost guy it's a lost taurus because there was a lot of potential between you and your person that none of you fought you know no one no one none of you bring it in the table and say we've got great chemistry why did you give up or in in one in one in a like simple things you're in the last process and no one follow up no one call no one brought that up we've got great chemistry why did you ghosted me or didn't reply or something to do what made you did i put you off something like that in 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 a nutshell it's more of no one followed nobody followed up something like that like it could be for some of you they ghosted you because it was um something went something 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 is hidden i feel like something is hidden something interrupted the way they like you the way they love you the way they admire you something hidden as well something hidden I don't think this person is over you yet i don't see a period because they explore other because you're too good you know i feel like taurus your connection between you and this person it was too good it it was too good that it went to platonic or playing safe that hmm maybe i set you aside because someone came along and oh let me explore this first okay because you're serious like you're the way this person see you is like end game your end of the game your marriage your um your marriage uh like you're the end of the game like if i commit to you that's engagement living in together and marriage okay and so for some of you they chicken out and instead of 
rejecting you or saying bye-bye they decided to ghost you off to explore i feel like they have they have explored it's either it's too serious it's too serious that they chicken out and wanted to explore that it's more of the last hooray it's like hen's party or a stag party before i get married with you before i get relationship with you taurus let me have my last hooray because you know they are exploring they're doing this stuff but look at them two of ones they look back you know this person is looking back at you because they never learn or they never get you know i feel like if they have explore or if they traveled or they try other stuff like if they prioritize work career or travel or if they've dated other people or if they have if they wanted to enjoy life before they commit to you you know they look back this is the two of ones they look back and they're kind of measuring where in this person right now current energy is that they're looking at what they did after you guys were not in speaking terms you know in during the time that you are not in talking you don't get update with each other so this person right now and the feb they're kind of thinking did my life improve or am i happy this way exploring traveling because they never feel some sort of planning or they never get the same chemistry or connection when you were together because you have a lot of common you know the way this person views your connection it's friendship and romantic that you could be a friend and a lover at the same time since you guys were not in speaking term they were just floating around they were floating they never feel connected to anybody um, versus the way they connected to you so this person is floating and reviewing and looking back okay let's see whether this person is gonna reach out seven of wands ace of swords and the devil card so i feel like this person they're open to reach out like if you call them if you text them they would respond quickly or right away um, but I feel like they're still sorting out things in their life. They're still figuring things. Something to do. Because the devil card is in reverse. This is their aim. To remove toxic complexity or confusion. They're not yet there. Although they o they're open to, to hear news from you. Okay? This is your person and yourself. You mean a lot to this person. Alright? Because of the chemistry you have. It's a strong chemistry. Alright, so this is you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for being here today. I hope to see you soon. Have a great day. Bye-bye.